We are here. I only have an hour and a half or two hours left until the show starts. So I'm gonna start building. I really need to go to the bathroom. I'm kind of shook because I came like two years ago, and back then there was like like there was this big hall with like almost nothing but like art alley and this really big empty space and like a small ball pool. But now it's like so full actually super impressive it's actually very cool to see a con grow to be bigger like this that's awesome here is my booth everything looks great um, my neighbor is not gonna show up I think so maybe perhaps I can expand that'd be nice but um, otherwise cramped six foot as always um, but everything is where it should be. I came prepared. I even brought five guys hot dogs. I had no idea the con started because it was so empty but the con started it's been like 30 minutes um, I had someone come by saying that they watched my videos and gave me a snack bag thank you so much I am so excited to eat these because I was actually really craving sweets y'all shower me with beautiful gifts this is so cute thank you so much oh, look at him he's just resting I put him right here and I also have like a snack stash going on over there. Thank you guys. Ah, what a great start. Now 1 p.m. It's picking up. There's like some people, but it's definitely not like crowded or anything. It's just like a decent amount of people. And then so far I'm going through my snack stash pretty rapidly. It's because I'm so, I'm like just sitting here doing Staring, and I'm also really sleepy. I'm like running on four hours of sleep, so. Oh, thank you! Okay, it's 3 10. Uh, thank you, Gary, for staying at my table while I had to pee. Because, okay, normally I would just go on my own, but I don't have neighbors here. I'm a corner, so I clearly don't have neighbors. And then I don't even have a neighbor behind me. So then. I just felt like I was just like a single island floating, so vulnerable, so I asked Gary to watch my table. I'm bored, so it's bread time. Thank you, Kiko. Hi! Hi. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you! It looks so good. It looks so good. Thank you, Liang, for this Clementine suffering. It's very empty as you can see. Um Yeah, I'm I'm doing okay. Cleaned up, but day one's done. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I need to sleep. I actually need to sleep so bad. Oh my god. It's, the sky is crazy. It's like a beautiful orange. Oh 
That's insane. I haven't seen a sunset like this in The clouds look like like each of its own. Officially day two of anime magic soon. Um, I expanded my table. I like opened it a little since my neighbors are not here. So that and then it looks a lot better. Thank you Kiko for the panels on the back because that saved. I, I, it might have knocked over otherwise. And then um, and then yeah. So everything looks good. Hoping it's a better day. More crowded. Yeah, you know. So bad and then gonna vibe. I need to eat. Good morning. Goofy fruit snacks. Sanji soba. Oh. Maybe? You give it enough? That smells delicious. No, thank you. Two has started, VIP hours. VIP hours don't matter to me. Because um, they, they're not coming for me <laughs> during VIP hours. And then uh, walking down. And we go to Kiko Paints. Woo! Oh, you put your number? Nice. Howdy. 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 Jamie's booth with no Jamie. So sad. Look how expanded anime magic is. Like two years ago this shit was like all empty and there was like a really sad deflated pool ball. But now it's like all filled with like exhibitor booths and everything. And I think that's so cool. I just saw Remen figures. That's so cute. Oh my god, those. These are beautiful. Ah, they're so pretty. Okay. Ah, the Totoro! It's like. It's the entrance. It's a bunch of people behind me. I feel very perceived. Um. And then Anime Magic has really cute like merch. I feel like their merch is honestly one of the cutest I've seen. That's so cute. Oh, they have skateboards too. That's really art. Oh, the blow up Mirakuma is so cute. Oh, Teyama is here. The, the Volvo place in Chinatown. So cute, beautiful. And then all the cars. So stunning. Wow, that's crazy. Never seen so many. Oh my god, that's crazy. Can you adjust it? Oh, that's so cool. <gasps> It's now 12.30, um, it's slow but um, not like terrible. I can hear like a crowd so I'm hoping they're like all trickling in or something because the vendor hall is really big. I feel like it would take forever for someone to end up at Artist Alley. Like it's a lot of walking and a lot of exhibitors actually look like Artist Alley booths so I wouldn't be surprised if they confused it too. So I'm just chilling here and just eating away again but here's my POV 
a bigger POV today because I expanded my table. But um, yeah, this is like the crowd currently. It's like there are people, but like not too crazy, you know? So I'm just chilling. This booth ended up not showing up. I'm kind of sad because I feel like people tend to avoid rows that have empty tables. So them having two booths empty was just like a big, like, sad moment. Donut time. It's like a cinnamon with like apple filling. It's really good. It's so good. Now 2 p.m. Um, there was like a burst of sales, so then um, I'm pretty happy, and then I'm gonna focus on drawing so I can stop zoning out and keep meeting eyes with my neighbor across me. I feel kind of bad, so I'll do some work. It's three. You know it's bad when I film often, and uh, I've been eating so many of the sweets, which I mean they're all really good. I'm just, but I'm so like weeded out I don't even know how to like describe it I want like actual food and I also want to stop eating out of boredom but yeah um, it's busier but it's definitely not like busy busy it's weird I like I had someone show up today and sold prints behind me and then now they're gone interesting anyways uh, there is a lock okay it's 4 30 and it's halfway through the con at this point and I am positive because I checked the numbers I am doing worse than when I got here at 2022 which is crazy because I have like way more stuff like my booth from 2022 um, I'll put it up here it was like so small like I have only keychains post-its and uh, microfiber cloths like half of whatever I had so I thought that like since I have so much more inventory and items that it would be so much better than 2022 at least which is why I was prompted to come back but I'm doing worse um, not by like a ton thankfully but I am doing worse for sure which is kind of crazy so I'm going to think about theories on why this happened oh shit <laughs> a few theories on what I think happened. I think it's mainly the attendance ratio to like the artist alley table ratio. I think there are way too many tables compared to like the attendee number that Anime Magic has. Anime Magic has expanded so much and it's so great to see like a small con to expand so much this far. But I think they almost did it too fast and it's affecting the vendors because there's like not that many attendants to cover like all of the tables here so then um and a customer come by but anyways my other theory is just that there's just too many cons this weekend like there's at least five there's like ndk there's sac anime anime impulse there's uh what's that face uh Masuri con there's san japan it's already five um there's so many cons and like I don't assume most people fly out but I mean that also just spreads people out in general so that's also my other theory and uh, Labor Day weekend surprisingly I thought it would bring more people but I think actually it sent people more out of the state so okay also a customer just handed me this what the hell what happened like this looks like it got moved. This definitely all got moved. This also is just like torn. Did someone do this? Like how did this just happen? Ugh. Damn. I mean, I hope it's an accident by someone, but like that does not look like an accident. I'm surprised they didn't take the sticker. They should have just taken it. It's now 6.30. Um, I had someone come up saying that they watched my vlogs. And they gave me presents. So I'm gonna open it up. For coming by and telling me that you guys watch my vlogs and like it's so sweet um magic card i'll put him on my sticker book and then oh animal crossing sticker
stickers. Like the fruit stickers. And then, oh, this is cute. This is the business card. Thank you so much. It is so cute. I love hollow stickers. Maybe I should make hollow stickers next. Very cute. Very, very cute. And then someone came by and gave me Bell for having Animal Crossing merch. Now I'll be out of death and Tom Nook will no longer haunt my dreams. But thank you. Just 30 minutes left. I had someone just come by with the most beautiful print of Kiki. It is so pretty. This is their artist name. Um, thank you guys for showering me with all these gifts. It means a lot. Thank you so much. I don't, I like sometimes just feel like I don't deserve all of this love, but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, Anime Magic has overall like number wise, like obviously not my best con out there, but people have been so kind and I had a lot of people come by and making new friends and everyone's so willing to like help and like you know be so encouraging so I'm having a good time um, I also think it's feeling a little like I think like the con feels a little underwhelming only because I've had like big cons before this like AX, Otakon and then obviously Anime Magic is a smaller scale con so I feel like I should lower my expectations in that sense so it's now 6.55, so five minutes before closing. I jinxed myself, which is a good thing because I did better than 2022 Anime Magic officially today. At least for Saturday. I don't know about Friday. I don't even want to check. But Saturday, at least, I did better than 2022. So that's a win. And yeah, so I'm just gonna... I overreacted, so I'm just gonna go eat K-Barbecue and chill. Day two is done. I cleaned up. My table cover is my tablecloth, so I'll just let it like sit like this, and then I'm gonna go home, eat barbecue, shower, and then pass out again. So yeah, um, some best fellers this weekend surprisingly pin banners. I'm happy. And then the bucket hats are doing really well. Sticker books pretty good, but um, the one piece sticker book is not selling as much as I thought. But yeah. Either way, I'm happy. Gonna eat. It's Gary. What's up? <laughs> Yay! He's leaving! <laughs> Goodbye. You guys are not coming back tomorrow. Please don't stop us, okay? <laughs> I haven't heard cicadas in so long. Actually. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Dinner time. Hello. Yeah. Because you can't unestablish. That makes sense. Okay, now we can. There, yeah, there we go. Mm -hmm. right. uh, this one I can put. That's true. But it's beautiful. Oh, thank you. And some scissors, yep. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. I got this desk mat for Josh because he's been like playing Pokemon on his emulator again. Mad EV training. And then I bought this postcard book. It's so cute. So beautiful. And then these are all the stickers. So pretty. This is his artist name. If everyone wants to follow him. Yeah. Liang's not here, but this is Liang's booth. Ta-da! Yeah, it's pretty empty. It's like what 10:30 on a Sunday, and it was just like. No one's here. So I'm just gonna wander a little. Oh shit. 
shit, there's so many empty tables. That's kind of sad. Um, then, uh, I'm just wandering. Howdy. <laughs> Here is my haul. Bought these stickers and then the postcard. So pretty. And then I also bought a desk mat for Josh because he's been. Well, I mentioned this earlier, but super excited. It is day three. I completely forgot to film because I was just. I was just goofing around um, and making my purchases but um, there's a lot more decision making going on in terms of purchases like people are buying 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 and I know some people that are closing early so then I think that's prompting people to buy things faster Hello. Um, so yeah and since it's only till 5 hopefully it will be a good day and I can go home happily and uh, yeah, so for now I'm just chilling and just on my iPad. I'm trying to like stay awake. Um, it is my second to last con of the year, so unless more cons take me, which I hope they do, um, I'll be chilling. Although I do think I need this break. I haven't been able to do anything like in terms of online shop or whatever that much as I as much as I wanted to because I was so busy with cons and I got so burnt out that I wasn't really touching anything there so I feel kind of bad but um, I am thinking about it and I am considering doing a big summer blowout over the end of summer after this because I really want to make some big changes to my shop this year so yeah so that's just my random rambling but anime magic so far has been solid Risa wrote me this cute note I forgot my yearbook so she gave me a whole paper that is so kind thank you Risa housed me this weekend and it's been such a good time I loved her cats and um, I had a really good time so thank you for housing me it's 107 it's like a lot busier for me than the past two days lots more transactions and sales so I'm happy lunch time bibimbap hello Liang is here Woo! it's now 2.50 I had lunch and I finally peed and it's like slowing down a lot and yeah so then um, I did a trade named Hockey Birds. I met a new friend today. Well, throughout the weekends, not just today, but stuff is really cute. Um, these are the three. I traded these cute starter Pokemon and then the sticker sheet. So cute! Thank you. And then um, the Peeping Pop was actually really buzzing. I was like so shook. Um, and then hopefully time will go by fast packed up soon then go home i want to go home can't wait for con summer season to be over because i am exhausted it's a lot of like i love seeing people but it's so tiring but grateful that i could spend this summer going to cons like this because um cons are getting really competitive so i'm very grateful for every opportunity i get to go to so hopefully i'll have more soon too and yeah i'm I know your magic went really well today, so I'm very happy. Coming down to the end of con, one hour left, and then this is a trade I did. I normally don't do trades, but this time I had so much time. So these two are from Choto. I forgot their name, but I will put their business name down on the caption. And then another one from Uni and Umi. She watches a lot of my vlogs and comments on them, so I remembered, but... Oh my god, thank you! <gasps> so cute! Oh man, hollow stickers are the in, and then this really cute dango keychain. It is 15 minutes until closing. Here's my booth after the three days. A lot of bucket hats sold out, and I'm very happy. Oh, 
so I'm going home very light. And then the grocery bags did surprisingly well. I think this display is actually working a lot better than whatever I had during AX. And then um, sticker sheets did okay. And then the sticker books did pretty well. I was very impressed. And then the shaker charms actually did pretty well too. So I was really happy. And then, yeah, so pin banners actually also did surprisingly well, which I was very happy about. So overall, a very happy con. I had some slow moments, but I'm still grateful for everyone who came by and people who told me that they watch my YouTube. Thank you so much. Well, yeah, so in 15, I'm gonna pack up. I also realized I actually did better today than Saturday or Friday. So it was like a, for me, so that's a win. So I'm happy. Sometimes you just, gotta trust the progress you know let it simmer and wait till the end so I'm happy that I waited it out okay I don't know they're straight up fucking what the hell okay there's a straight up like I don't know if you can see it all the Ita shows are like leaving that way they're being so loud getting heart attacks over it holy shit but yeah there's like straight up cars in here I have packed up speed run pack up and then I don't know if you can see it but my carry on luggage she, she has to go bye bye I totally forgot I had sky club access This is nice. So nice. I feel so bougie. Oh my god. Ah.